the top. But Papa Doc, I'm telling you, I've done a lot of jobs here in the ESFL, and then a lot of my job has been matchmaker. It, mm -hmm. It's always an issue whenever you, whenever you, somebody's going up against Papa Doc. They like, hey, uh, you know, I, I gotta go to school. Um, I, my my grandma called me to go to church. Like people <laughs> come up with Thursday. all kind of yeah. <laughs> <laughs> People come up with all kind of excuses not to fight Papa Doc because you're going to take an L. And I've I experienced that too. You you know, I've experienced watching uh, fighting Papa Doc in the ESFL, and it, it's mm -hmm. like, oh, okay, um, th these guys fighting on a, the next level. It's mm -hmm. another level. Than it's what different. You fight. Yeah, yeah, you like, oh, I, I'm I'm top 100 in OWC. Like, uh, no, come in the ESFL. Let, let us show you what Mom, it's really it like. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, it don't even matter. But you fighting, he's fighting his equal. Right now, mm -hmm. in GOAT mm -hmm. 1099. And this is, I, yeah, this is it. Man, this is going to be, this is a clash of superpowers. This is the Hulk fighting the thing. This is, yeah. you know, here we go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, GOAT 1099 with that Max Holloway pickup has a lot of stamina, really good. Um, you know, with the stand up thing, but Papa Doc, he, he's a he's great on the ground and he's mm -hmm. picking up Conor McGregor. This is going to be interesting because I think this ground, this game is going to be on the feet and with two great strikers here. Which is, I mean, yeah, uh, but Papa Doc, like you said, at any moment is just so good on the ground. Yeah, man. on the ground, yeah. It's going to be kind of jarring to see. Oh, wow. Look at, I was wow. going to say it's going to be jarring to see McGregor, McGregor initiate a grappling. Uh, Exchange, but it's it's just as jarring to see Holloway do the same. So, <laughs> yeah, and and what you see in there, these guys had that fifty fifty scenario. Whenever you put mm -hmm. somebody in the clinch, and it's like, hey, do I block high? Do I block low? I, I might risk the takedown. And what you were able to see, Papa Doc was able to uh, to to actually block high and then also defend the takedown. These guys mm -hmm. are good. Um, side step there, intercepted Papa by Papa Doc's Doc with a huge right hand. Block. Yeah, working it big time. Side step right into that left hook, that right hook. Goat still doing some good job defending, but I mean, he looks like he's trying to find his rhythm. Whereas Papa Doc's like, I'm taking the fight to you. Yeah, I'm gonna you see that head health. I'm gonna mm -hmm. drop your block and your head health. Like he's Papa Doc's going for the knockout, and it looks like he wants it early. Yeah, you but know, again, and the thing he, yeah, Goat's been here. He knows mm -hmm. what to do, and um, he's making adjustments as we speak. He's able to get off the cage. Look, grab. Um, in the clinch, get get the fight right back Smart. in the middle. That gets yep. that gets him a lot of space. You know, you get that clinch, yep. you start driving forward. It gives him some, a lot more room to work. You never want your back against the cage. I don't care who you're fighting against. Yeah, and one thing I'm seeing, Max Holloway, you're going to have that stamina advantage on Conor McGregor. So uh, this might play out, and this is a five round fight. So you can't, you got to watch your pacing. You can't mm -hmm. fight it like a three round fight. Right. All right, Conor counter miss. Yeah, I was gonna say Connor's just like a shadow on him uh, in front of the fence, and but Max is fighting back. And he's he's trying not to let himself get back. I mean, I, don't I say backed up too far. He can't go any farther back. But he's trying yeah. not to. He's trying to mitigate the the trouble that he's in here. You know, he's yep. just trying to make sure that even if I am, even if I do have my back against the cage, I can pull a Zayaf and just start swinging back. And you know. Yep. So one one thing, um, Goat is he's he's kind of like Ed. He knows how to work your stamina. And mm -hmm. so that's what I'm seeing right now. Uh, Goat is, you know, like, let me survive these rounds, you know, because I'm putting in the work for the later rounds. I'm going to drag you into this deep water where I'm mm -hmm. going to shine. You know, mm -hmm. so if because if you don't pour on that pressure with Conor McGregor early and look at your stamina is going down, your long-term stamina, you could be in trouble. But look at that Absolutely. head help blinking on Goat. I was going to say, he's trying to, he's trying to, you know, wait and weather the storm and then drag him into the deep waters, but... If the ship crashes before you can get out into the ocean, man. Like, yeah, exactly. Uh, you in trouble. Yeah, so last uh, 13 seconds here. I'm not sure who won that round. I want to say Papa Doc has done more damage, but yeah, I think he could Papa be Doc in more trouble. Yep, I he think Papa be. Doc won it, yeah. But I think he may be in more trouble, but we're going to see it later in the round. But mm -hmm. at any time, Papa Doc can pull out that secret weapon, call his ground game, and just mm -hmm. change the complexion of the fight. Exactly. He didn't go for a takedown that last round. Max went for one, but didn't get it. Yeah. And we're gonna see if if Papa Doc's able to, like like you said, pull out that secret weapon, activate his genjutsu, and go to the ground. So exactly. Yeah. But when you fighting Papa Doc, it's like, yeah, we we know you got something in your hip pocket. <laughs> yeah. Just waiting to, to bring it out. Look at there. Oh. Go. 
gets a knockdown and he has a stamina lead. So Papa Doc is going to have to make an adjustment. Oh my goodness, Ghost, I'm trying to defend it real quick. He said, all right, wow. you got yours in. Now let me go ahead and wake up and show you what's up. Yeah, huge Papa knockdown Doc here. Trying to fight to survive. He gets off the cage. They're back in the center, but that head held does not look good for your boy. Yeah, man, that, see, that's the thing with Max Holloway with all of that striking speed and all of that striking power. And then, look, oh, Papa Doc gets a rock and a knockdown of his own. Kevin has got cinder blocks in those gloves, man. If he touches wow. you, if he touches you, it could be Touch seconds away from being over. And there it is. There's go. that ground game. There's that secret weapon pulled out by Papa Doc. Now, now we got to think we're in Papa Doc's world. But yep. Max is able to get back into the top full guard. You got to yeah, wonder if maybe he caught him by surprise, if there was you know, some lag input. Maybe his fingers just didn't work the way he wanted them to. But regardless, GOAT 1099 is on top. And he's doing some damage to Connor's body right now. Yeah, a lot of times you really got to be sitting on that transition up. And especially if you um, if you do one of the power transitions, it might mm -hmm. come out faster than expected. Um, but but GOAT, no, no stranger to the ground himself. Uh, so no, both no, of these no. guys amazing in all scenarios. All right, go 1099, raining down some huge strikes here. Look at the block, look the at the ball. head health. He's doing a lot of work to Papa Doc right now. Yeah, and see, this is one of the examples. There's no reason to even forward here because, look, I can do what I need to do right here in your right car. Here. Exactly. Like, like, I'm good. I ain't got to go nowhere. I'm, On like, top of that, the guard is, you know, the easiest denials, in my opinion. You know. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, so, so let's yeah, see. If he can stay here and do his work, why leave? If it ain't yeah, broke. Exactly. Yeah, don't try to fix it. Like, look at this, man. Getting He's throwing. Good shots in on that ground and pound, man. It's, yeah. it's kind of impressive. I say kind of. It's very impressive how he's able to do this to Papa Doc. And one thing that I'm noticing, he was throwing combinations with the same hand. A lot of times we used mm -hmm. to people always switching hands. But if you, if you alternate between straight and hook on the same hand, a lot of times people may not anticipate that. So it's good to kind of mix it up like that. Exactly. And then when they do start anticipating, <laughs> then you bring the left hand to the party. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, or now now I'm a transition on you. Exactly. You know, but and the crazy thing is we talked about GOAT and that secret weapon, Papa Doc is like, come on, man. I'm I'm called GOAT for a reason. <laughs> so now he's yeah, been exactly. on the ground. Yeah, control. You know, but we yeah, go ahead. I was just gonna say, you know, Papa Doc was able to get this fight to the ground at the beginning of this round, but then GOAT said, Hold on, we're gonna get up, I'm gonna knock you down, and then we're gonna go back to the ground on my terms. Yeah, so. exactly. Man, wow. what a reversal of fortunes. Yeah, now this is going to be interesting now because whenever you had a Conor McGregor pickup, you just naturally do not have the attributes on yeah, the ground. Worse, the longer yeah, goes. yeah and, and, and I mean, Max Holloway is no beast on the ground himself, uh, but... Uh, the but gas tank makes all the yeah, difference. All the difference. And so it's a slight stamina advantage there for Go. I thought it would be more, but look at that head health low there on Papa. Exactly. Up. Oh, huge but kick. It doesn't matter kick. with a huge front kick. Yeah, Papa Doc is able, he's sneaky and he's crafty and he's able to land that front kick on GOAT 1099 to get the rock to start out the third round. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say we've got another momentum shift on our hands, boss. Yeah, back and forth. And this is what we expected. This fight mm -hmm. has not disappointed so far. Rock None back and forth whatsoever. another rock. A Good huge slip right Max is here. able to keep surviving, man. He's circling out, but he catches Papa Doc on the way in. Yeah, now let's see what the what Goat is going to do. Uh, now Goat going for the takedown, bails out. Tries to get those quick shots from the uh, the double under right there. Oh, I got the... <laughs> out of nowhere! Go 1099, wow. a huge kick! He looked oh, like he hit him with a baseball bat. What was that? He looked yeah. like, oh my God. That's zombie out killer of the week. That's wow. zombie killer of the week. <laughs> we were just settling into the fight. And yes. I mean, it's just like, I'm getting ready to commentate for a little bit more. It's like, no, we, we ending this right now. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That is... We, what? <laughs> man. I mean, that's that, wild. like I don't even. Yeah, out of nowhere, man. I mean, anytime you got that high level of striking, right? I mean, it can mm -hmm. end just like that. Mm -hmm. And so, Goat Ten Ninety Nine showing why his striking is is superior. Like it's always been like that, and that's why mm -hmm. I was surprised with Papa Doc 
to get just a, like a pure striker because I feel like he's one of the best guys on the ground. Right. Um, you know, but it's nothing wrong with, you know, doing something different this time. Go 1099, you live in his world. When you want that stand up, he shows the reason mm -hmm. why. Great.